Look at this picture behind me. I mean, just look at this unity here, right? Well, the Women's World Cup continues with the U.S. team taking on Portugal tomorrow. And while change continues to surround the sport, a local soccer star from the 70s says that there's still a ways to go. Beverly Ranger is credited with being the first woman to make a living playing soccer in Germany. And the Jamaican-born player is rooting for the U.S. and her home country. The Queen City News reporter Will Lewis tonight has a story live from West Charlotte. And Will, after retiring, Hiring from soccer, she has actually been working in the CMS system, right? Yeah, that's right. She has worked in the CMS system. And, you know, Beverly Ranger tells us that she's kind of taken a step back from the sport since retiring. But she says she is watching the World Cup. She never considered herself a pioneer. She just liked playing a game she enjoyed. The pictures of Beverly Ranger playing soccer overseas show the joy and love she gained for the game. I started in England by playing in the park with the boys. I guess one could say I started at a very late stage. I started when I was 16. The game came naturally to the woman born in Kingston, Jamaica. She played in England and then for German club Bonner SC, where she helped the club win a championship in 1975. Never in my wildest dream thought, you know, it would explode like that. I just started off just having fun in the park. Ranger also won the coveted German Goal of the Month award that year. Only the second woman to win the award at that time. She retired in 1989 and moved to the U.S. When talking about the current World Cup, a thumb went up before I could even ask who she is rooting for. It has to be Jamaica. I'm rooted all 110% for Jamaica. Not because it's my heritage, but we're a very small island. And for those young ladies to have accomplished back-to-back -back qualifying for the World Cup. That is a great accomplishment. Ranger says when the team won its first World Cup match versus Panama. I jumped and I screamed. She is also rooting for the United States women as well. More importantly, she is rooting for women of color. Beverly Ranger, named the female Pele by some, dealt with racism, but says each match, the sport, gets a little better. Young girls, need to have someone that reflects their image to give them the hope, the courage to say, one day this could be me. And those success stories come off the foot of a woman who's still realizing the role she played in this global game. Other people have always made more of my accomplishment than myself, you know, and um, sometime I have to pinch myself. I'm sorry. Did I do all those things? And, you know, but on the other hand, I guess it's an honor to be thought of as a pioneer. Yeah, and Ranger says that she tries to keep a low profile right now, and she takes her sports talents now to the tennis court. She says she hasn't been to Bank of America yet, but she plans on going to watch a Charlotte FC match. Live in West Charlotte, Will Lewis, Queen City News. Pretty